morning students we continue our chapter fractions decimals and rational numbers in this we will discuss exercise 5 first bit is which one is greater 0.7 or 0.07 0.7 means 7 by 10 0.07 means 7 by 7 is divided 10 times means 7 is made into 10 parts this is greater or 7 is made into 100 parts this is greater for example we are taking one chocolate okay this chocolate is made into 10 parts 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 Ten parts you make. If you have to make hundred parts, how many times you have to do? So this is greater, no? Seven by ten is greater than seven by hundred. Second one, seven or eight point five. After seven, you will be getting eight. Okay, eight, eight point one, eight point two, eight point three. So which is greater? Eight point five is greater than. Seven. Third one, one point four seven or one point five one. See, one is same for both. Next of the point, you see four five, which is greater five. Therefore, one point five one is greater than one point four seven. Next fourth one, six or zero point six six, which is greater now. Here zero is there. Here six, six is greater than zero point six six. Next, second bit express the following as rupees using decimals. Nine paisa. Same, one rupee equal to hundred paisa, right? So to convert pies into rupees, you have to divide it by hundred. You have to divide it by hundred for what? For converting pies to rupees. Okay. So what you have to convert nine pies into rupees? So what you have to divide nine should be divided by. Hundred. Therefore, it is nothing but zero point zero nine rupees. Is it clear? Yes. Next one, seventy seven rupees seven paisa. Have you will write seventy seven rupees means seventy seven into hundred, right? Ah. Uh, And seven paisa. Okay, seventy-seven into hundred. Why I am multiplying by hundred? I am converting it to paisa. Seven seven double zero. And seven. How you will write this one? Otherwise, you see, seventy-seven rupees seven paisa. No. So we will convert this pies into rupees. Seventy-seven rupees. How to convert pies into rupees? Seven by hundred. Now you have to write this one. Seven by hundred means zero point zero seven. Now you add both seventy-seven plus zero point zero seven. How you will write seventy-seven point zero seven? Rupees. Understood? Yes. Next third one. Two thirty five pies. Two thirty five 
235 pi to convert pi into rupees what you have to do divide it by 100 what you will be getting 2.35 rupees is it clear children yes in the next class we'll discuss still more okay thank you